Mark also goes to his house. And every day Mark watches adult videos at home and then falls asleep. When it is morning, his mother comes to pick him up. She tells Mark that your uncle and Jenna are coming. Mark's uncle and Jenna then come to Mark's house. Jenna was a Russian. While Jenna is serving food to everyone, Mark starts staring at Jenna, then Mark's sister starts telling Mark how everyone was looking at her. It was because of Jenna's dress that everyone was seeing her like this. And later there comes his mother. And she tells them that maybe this will be Russian fashion, and we shouldn't judge anyone by her clothes. We learn that Jenna was already married, and has a daughter named Natasha. Jenna goes to Russia to pick her up. When she returns, everyone picks her up at the airport, where Mark first meets Natasha, who is 14 years old. After a few days Mark's uncle and Jenna got married and everyone in the party was happily having dinner. But this Natasha was getting bored here, so Mark's mother told Mark that, Natasha is getting bored here. So show him your house. Mark takes Natasha to show him his house as well as his room. Then Natasha asks Mark, what do you do here? So Mark says I only watch TV in my room. Then Natasha says that you have not made out with any girl here. Mark is shocked to hear this, and he says, how can you do such things, you are 14 years old now. And you have no shame in doing such things. Then Natasha says that, till now I have done with more than 100 boys. And if you want, I can do all that with you too. On hearing this Mark says that, my uncle has married your mother and because of this we are cousins. Hearing this, Natasha tells Mark that, I hate my mother, and she is a lousy lady, and she is having an affair with many men. And I have seen all this myself. But Mark falls silent after this, and Mark's mother tells Mark that Natasha has come to this country for the first time. And you have to take care of him. And you have to spend some time with him. Because he doesn't have any friends here. This Mark was listening to his mother, but he knew very well what kind of girl Natasha was. The next day Mark goes to Natasha's house. Where Jenna tells him that, Natasha always prefers to be alone. And she's a different kind of girl, if she ever gets angry with Mark, Mark doesn't mind. After this, Natasha's mother calls them. But some fight was going on between them. So Natasha gets angry with this. And goes out from there. When she leaves, Mark also follows her. Where he asks Natasha what is the matter, what happened? Then Natasha tells that she does not even want to see her mother's face. And by bringing her here, he has ruined Natasha's life even more. Mark then takes her to the house of his friend Rufus. Where Natasha meets Rufus, but after that Natasha always starts asking about Rufus. Mark tells her that his parents are divorced, and Rufus lives alone. After which both have lunch together. And after spending a long time, Mark leaves Natasha at home. And Natasha tells her as she leaves. That tomorrow I will come to your house. And the next day while he is studying Mark, Natasha comes to visit him. Where they both talk for a while. And then go out with a bicycle. Now here we come to know that Mark sells ball to his friends. Which Natasha also sees, and she asks Mark if I can smoke too. Then the next day when Natasha comes to Mark's house. So Mark makes her bald. After this Natasha takes Mark's permission, and starts using his laptop, as soon as she turns on the laptop, she watches adult videos in it, which Mark had left just like that. And Natasha is happy seeing this, and takes the laptop to Mark. Comes and tells her that, I want to show you something. She starts showing her nude photos to Mark. And she says too. She also makes dirty videos. And she starts seducing Mark. And starts taking off her clothes. And even Mark can't stop himself. After this Natasha tells Mark about herself that, she started doing all this at the age of 12. And his mother also came to know about it. And she used to do all this only for money. And his mother wanted to grab his money. This was the reason, their relationship was not going well. After that both started meeting every day and in the meantime Mark has fallen in love with Natasha. And he takes her to the party, and goes roaming around the city. After a few days Mark's uncle and Jenna now move out. So Natasha was staying at Mark's house. Both were chatting at night and then went to sleep saying good night. But after a while Natasha comes to Mark's room. And she says that she can't sleep. So they both go out. Where Natasha tells Mark that, I like it very much. She says if I wish she could live her whole life, Mark tells her that, this is your house, you can come here whenever you want. After this Natasha tells Mark that, my mother is cheating on your uncle. And he is still having an affair with someone. She says, I have told this to your uncle. But he didn't believe me. And after a few days I started thinking of a liar. And later we see that his uncle comes back. And he asks Natasha to accompany him. 
But Natasha categorically refuses. That she would not go with him. So his mother tells him. That I know why you want to be with him. And at the same time she also says that, I know what you do with Mark. And Natasha gets very angry on this. And she starts fighting Jenna, then Mark's father stops them. And Natasha has to go with Jenna unwillingly. The next day Mark goes to Natasha's house. Where he says sorry to Jenna, then Jenna says. It's not your fault in this. She is a very spoiled girl, she has made relationships with many big men. By saying that you are a child. And Jenna tells Mark to leave. And that night does not even allow Natasha to meet. Natasha comes to Mark's house with all her belongings. And tells Mark that she is going to Florida. And she asks him if she would like to come further. And she says my mother and your uncle got divorced. And it's all because of me. Because I slept with your uncle. So that their relationship breaks down. Because I didn't want my mother to ruin your uncle's life. That night Natasha stayed at Mark's house. When morning comes, Mark gives her some money. What he had saved. So that she can get some help, and Natasha leaves with all her belongings. Here Mark's family was upset thinking that why his uncle broke this marriage, because no one knew the truth. And here Mark's friend Rufus was calling him again and again. But he didn't pick up the phone. It is only a few days later, when Mark goes to the Rufus house. He sees that Natasha was there. Rufus tells her that, I was calling you to tell me the same thing. But you weren't picking up the phone. Further he says that, Natasha will be safe with me, only then Natasha comes there. And she looks at Mark angrily. Mark also gets angry. And goes